Cygnus CRS 0A6, also known as Orbital ATK CRS 6, is the sixth flight of the Orbital ATK unmanned resupply spacecraft Cygnus and its fifth flight to the International Space Station under the Commercial Resupply Services contract with NASA. The mission launched on March 23, 2016, at 11.05 p.m. The Cygnus spacecraft for this mission is named the SS Rick Husband in honor of astronaut Rick Husband. History The first COTS demonstration mission with a Cygnus concluded successfully in September 2013 and Orbital commenced operational ISS cargo missions under the Commercial Resupply Service program with two missions in 2014. However, the third operational mission, Orb CRS-3, was unsuccessful due to catastrophic failure of its Antares 130 launch vehicle. Orbital discontinued the Antares 100 series in favor of the planned Antares 200, upgraded with newly built Road 181 first stage engines to provide greater payload performance and increased reliability. While the Antares 200 was under development in 2015 2016, the company contracted with United Launch Alliance for the Atlas V launch of CRS 0A4, which occurred on 6 December 2015, to be followed by the Atlas V launch of CRS 0A6 on the 23rd of March 2016. Orbital ATK plans subsequent launches of CRS 0A5 in Q3 2016 and CRS 0A7 in Q4 2016 on the new Antares 230. Together with CRS 0A6, these missions will enable Orbital ATK to cover their initial CRS contracted payload obligation. Production and integration of Cygnus spacecraft is performed in Dulles, Virginia. The Cygnus service module is mated with the pressurized cargo module at the launch site, and mission operations are conducted from control centers in Dulles and Houston. Launch On 23 March 2016, UTC, Cygnus CRS 0A6 was successfully launched by the Atlas V into low Earth orbit. During the flight, the rocket had a first stage anomaly that led to shutdown of the first stage engine approximately five seconds before anticipated. The anomaly forced the Centaur upper stage of the rocket to fire for approximately one minute longer than planned, using reserved fuel margin, but did not significantly impact payload orbital insertion. The pre-planned deorbit burn successfully deorbited the stage, but not precisely within the designated location. The issue marked the first Atlas V anomaly in over eight years to be publicly acknowledged by ULA. Topic: Spacecraft. OA6 is the fifth of ten flights by Orbital ATK under the Commercial Resupply Services contract with NASA. This was the second flight of the enhanced-sized Cygnus PCM. The delay of the NOAA GOES-R satellite from March 2016 to October 2016 created this Atlas V launch opportunity for CRS 0A6 to be launched before 0A5. The mission was launched on the 23rd of March 2016 in keeping with an orbital ATK tradition. This Cygnus spacecraft is named the SS Rick Husband after the NASA astronaut who commanded the Space Shuttle Columbia's ill-fated STS-107 mission in 2003. Topic: <laughs> Manifest Total weight of cargo: 3,513 kilograms, 7,745 pounds, using enhanced Cygnus. Crew supplies: 2,511 pounds, 1,139 kilograms. Crew care packages: 169 bulk overwrap bags of food, six bulk overwrap bags of U.S. Food for Russian crew Hygiene towels for Russian crew 
Printer ink and paper Vehicle hardware, £2,443 Multiplexer demultiplexer circuit cards Charcoal, brine and bacteria filters for ECLESS Water sampling kit Toilet inserts, urine receptacle with hose, toilet paper Science and research, £1,713 20 Flock 2E CubeSats. Human research program resupply Meteor Computer resources, £216 Newserbook laptop and printer 160 GB hard drive for IBM ThinkPad Canon XH camcorder, ghost camera, Nikon cameras, 50mm lens, USB card reader Assorted cables EVA spacewalk gear, £346 Legs, boots, arms and hard upper torso for spacesuit Socket caddy assembly METOX canisters for carbon dioxide removal Contamination detection kit Topic Sapphire 1 Sapphire 1 is a NASA test to study flammability and fire propagation in space using the CRSOA6 after it has delivered cargo to the International Space Station the spacecraft is fitted with various sensors and cameras to record data during what is expected to be a 20-minute fire, to determine how much fire resistance is needed in the ultra-light material used in the spacecraft and astronauts' gear. OA-6 will later disintegrate as it enters the Earth's atmosphere. Other orb projects After this OA-6 flight, NASA plans to launch two more Cygnus cargo missions in 2016, OA-5 on 6 July and OA-7 on 30 December. They will be followed by three flights from the extended contract, OA-80 on 12 June 2017, OA-9E later in 2017 and OA-10E in 2018. The schedules in early 2017 are dynamic, due to the first manned commercial flights SpaceX, Boeing to ISS. <laughs> <laughs> 